My name is Juana. I'm like many Christian women of my generation. Despite discrimination against us, we continue to believe in God and to gather for worship. We kept the faith. We shared our experience of the Word of God. Got my microphone. <laughs> We shared our experience of the Word of God with our children and grandchildren. From us, they learned that God loves them. They began to believe in God. We kept our churches open even when just a few people came to worship. We were the living stones, giving reason for our hope. This is why we are women with both joy and pain. For we have both experienced resistance and seen how truth flourishes. Our people receive the word of God with gladness. Praise be to God. Thank you. 
I like to oh, sorry. I like to come to church every Sunday and talk to my friends about God. I live with my mother. My father is a doctor and is working in Venezuela. I am proud of him, but I miss my daddy. Even though my mother doesn't come to church with me, I always tell her what they teach me here. Lord of history, all generations have praised your name. We joyfully praise your presence and join with the singing of the mountain bird, the palm trees, the rivers, and all the creation. Jesus, wise master, the source of eternal values where we drink the love. We praise you with the sound of the guitars.
We also need God's love and wisdom, which flows like a stream of water. Let's take some time to confess that we have not accepted the invitation to receive this love from God. Let us unite our voices asking for forgiveness with this song. And the song is, O oh Master, let me walk with thee. And it's found on page 186 of the hymn.
Jesus is open to us, like those who are open to him. In this particular encounter, Jesus declares, Truly I tell you, whoever does not receive the kingdom of God as a little child will never enter in. In silence, reflect on the attitudes of the differences, different characters in this story. Which attitude has been yours? To whom does Jesus open himself and whom does he challenge others to imitate?
We thank you for the people who work diligently for social, economic, cultural, and spiritual development for, of our country. We pray that you bring down the walls erected by the economic embargo into wide open doors that are ready to receive. Hear, Hear our prayers, prayers O oh Lord. It is time now to receive our offering. And just a reminder, if you are putting a check in the offering, to please make that check out to Church Women United with a notation for World Day of Prayer. Uh, we will um, turn all those offerings into the World Day of Prayer office. Yeah. Across the globe on the first Friday in March, women around the world get to the World Day of Prayer offering. The money is collected by national committees and it's used to perpetuate the work of World Day of Prayer, including preparing worship services like this one. The offerings are also used to fund grants to organizations working on issues that affect women and children, both in the United States and worldwide. We ask you to give generously now in faith that God's radical love will spread through our gifts. God of joy, from you we receive the gift of joy to share with others. Thank you for being a God that brings a childlike joy to our midst. Jubilant spirit who is present in simplicity, in our relationships, and in our daily routines. Thank you because we can receive the spirit of eternal joy. Thank 
into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Let us go into the world with a heart full of the tenderness of children, of the hope of God's kingdom, and knowing that as you receive children, you receive me. God blesses us and sends us to receive children with prayer, faith, perseverance, commitment, and joy. We receive the blessing and the mission of caring for and celebrating all of life. May your life gather us and invite us to receive life fully and to receive Jesus. Go in peace. Amen. And I just want to... Uh, recognize our little guest this morning, Lydia, <laughs> who did uh, Jesus Loves Us, Jesus Loves Me for us, and you're such a delight and we hope you'll come to us. <laughs> I want to thank all of those who participated in the service and those who attended, and especially again, the little one who sang the solo. <laughs> Next year's word, uh, World Day of Prayer will be written by the women of the Philippines. The subject is, am I being unfair? 